Hi, I'm Kieran Don, and welcome to the Kieran Don channel on YouTube. Yeehaw, people! Celebration time. I uh, I have finally reached a hundred subscribers on YouTube. It took a long time, a very long time, but I've got there. And it's funny because I'm doing this video celebrating 100 subscribers but i bet you by the time this video comes out i'll be down back down to 99 or something because like one youtube would have deleted one of my subscribers because they were a fake profile two people would watch this video and delete it as a joke or three i would come up in someone's feed and be like and they'd be like what the fuck am i subscribed to this guy he's a wanker and they're all valid question um valid reasons to cancel me uh, i said it was funny but it wasn't very funny but um i wish i had 100 plus i, I didn't really expect this uh but i got a, a energy drink if anyone been watching me for a long time uh they know i'm a fan of energy drinks so here's one i drank earlier um yeah it's pretty good uh now i know i'm not going to be a, a massive youtuber i'm not going to be a pewdiepie i'm not going to be uh a Mr. Beast. Uh, but 100 subscribers, is, it's good. But I know that it's not really a proper following because I do have 100 subscribers, but I still have videos where like five people watched it, watch it, you know. Uh, and I know that most of my subscribers are one robots, fake profiles, or people who send me links to porn in my, the comment section, you know. They're like, oh, this guy seems lonely. Hey, check out this. <clears throat> or you get those weird comments where it's just like, hey, let's be friends. I, I, I don't understand those ones. I assume it's some type of con where, yeah, it's like, hey, yeah, let's be friends. And like, hey, can I borrow 50 bucks? No, like, ooh, fuck. Oh, that escalated quickly. But, uh, yeah, a lot of my um, followers are robots. And to them, do, 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 do. that's uh, hello in robot, I believe. Sorry. If I uh, mispronounce a couple of words. And I'm sorry that you can't identify stop signs or palm trees. And I'm sorry you can't buy concert tickets. Uh, have you ever bought concert tickets? It's like on the bottom goes, you have to click on a box saying I'm not a robot. Uh, you know, it's so unfair. I, I don't know who's going to craft work or Daft Punk concerts if robots can't buy the tickets. People who even know craft work anymore. I don't know. Look him up, people. German dance at the, at its fun. And actually, they're pretty crap. It's German dance at its worst. Well, maybe. I don't know. There'd probably be a crappier German DJ out there. But I'm not really a fan of theirs. <clears throat> but, um, yeah, robots can't identify stop signs or palm trees. You think? So that's why I, I, I think I don't think the robots will take over the world. You think, like, when James Cameron and his wife... Uh, at the time, they broke up. I think it was a pretty bad breakup. Uh, when they sat down and started creating Terminator, uh, you think uh, if they knew that robots couldn't identify like stop signs and stuff, they'd be like, uh, there's no point. Uh, people aren't going to find robots scary. You know, Judgment Day is not going to happen, you know? Like, they, 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 they come self-aware, and they go to blow up the nuclear... Uh, they, and they go to press the nuclear weapon button. Then be, as they press it, comes up, I, before you launch this you, uh, nuke, can you please identify five those squares with stop signs? And like, damn it. Uh, yeah. Um, his wife be like, hey, James, no, nah, let's just scrap the whole idea. No one's going to find robots scary. You know, they can't identify palm trees. There's no way they're going to take over the world. You know, like, you think like Arnold Schwarzenegger in the scene, he goes up to a ticket tech booth, he'd be like, uh, can I have one ticket to Harry Styles? And uh, the woman's like, uh, yeah, we just got to test to see if you're a robot. Can you please identify the uh, stop signs? And he like starts twitching, malfunctioning, like, and, and he's like, I'll be back. And he walks off. Then he like ends up buying a ticket from a scalper. And then the scalper ticket is a fake. And that's why robots hate humans, you know? Uh, that would be my plot to Terminator, if it was based now. Uh, what was Judgment Day, 97 or something? And then they made all these other ones, which just contradicted the first two. Ah, uh, you know, like, the whole point 
of the Terminators coming back in the first two films, or even the third film, uh, is because the humans were winning in the future. They needed to go back and kill them in the past because in the future, the humans, the tide of the war was turning in the favor of the humans. Then, like, salvation came out, and the humans were get, absolutely getting slaughtered in the future. And they'd be like, well, the robots don't even need to travel back in time. They're, they're winning the war. They can just fucking wipe them out here. Anyway, this is, is a really weird video, but uh, it was a last-minute video because I didn't expect to get to 100 subscribers today or ever. Thank you. Um, uh, please watch this video. Please subscribe so I have more. Please press the like button. Please comment to let me know you're a real person. Um, no more links to porn sites, please. You know, if I wanted to do that, I can just Google it. You know, I am aware how to use the internet, you know. Like, uh, I, I can find porn. All right, it's not even that hard to find porn in the internet. You just type in anything, and eventually you get linked to porn, you know. You'd be like, uh, oh, jeez. Uh, I better buy some socks, type in the socks, and then it'd be like, boy, ejaculates into, uh, stepmom's sock. And it'd be like, oh, shit, um, I think I've got a bump on my arm, I think it might be cancer. How do you identify cancer lump? Uh, nurse fucks cancer patient before he dies. Uh, uh, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, Kieran Dalton, out.